comes the moment of truth. Oh my god, even no tension. Let's start today's workout. I realized I started to think my back hurts. It's work. Oh my. Uh, jump squats. I will have six pack after this. It's the day after my first La Seraphim workout. Very sore abs. I want to check out whether I have abs already. This is working. I wasn't sure whether I'm gonna do this challenge even until this morning I realized the pain. I love it. Look at this. I'm expecting some more defined abs. Literally, I feel like I can't move. One thing I'm really happy about is it's really not as scary as I once thought it is. Um, okay, this is me tucking. No tucking. Let's do a no tucking one. I don't know whether I'm just bloated or not. Mm, 67. Okay, 67. It's gonna go down. The before after picture will be like before after. <laughs> I can do this right now. Dinner time again. I realized I started to binge eat quite a bit. I get quite more hungry because this level of exercise is more than what I would usually do. And there's a bit of stress about like doing the workout. So I'm gonna pace it. Okay, it's day 16. Literally just had KFC for breakfast. Most importantly, I'm not seeing much result. Okay, I've picked up myself to do a seraphim workout. It's finally the last week of the La Seraphim challenge. I actually is going to finish. I feel strong. This morning, I think I just broke the record of finishing the whole workout in 20 minutes. My posture is getting better with those plank poses. Apps wise, I try to not like look at it. I want to surprise myself. Okay, here comes the moment of truth. <laughs> with the before and after. But I'm suspecting maybe it wouldn't look too much different. Regardless, I feel great. No. I can't wait to finish the workout actually. No. 